Hi mate, if you want to measure your uh, laser diode power and compare uh, with other module, but you don't want to buy a professional cheap, <laughs> not professional, but cheap uh, laser power meter, this cost about $100 and it's uh, very costly. You can buy a Peltier Celt, this one is a Peltier Celt, 3 cm side and connect uh, to a uh, multimeter so you can measure the voltage that uh, the laser uh, generate because of the thermal difference, temperature difference uh, from the hot side and uh, the cold side I have connected to a socket uh, chipset heatsink so we have a cold side and a hot side without the laser the voltage is near zero volt but when I turn on the laser the laser should be unfocused okay we can measure that uh, the voltage increase it uh, increase until a certain point and then it stops Okay, we are near the balance point. The balance point uh, is the point where the hot side of the Peltier cell stop uh, being uh, hot and uh, the, the heat is transferred to the heat sink. Okay, 0 0.45, no, 0 0.40, so, pardon. 0.404 okay this is uh, the measure i have uh, on uh, uh, this uh, atom stack a5 module that is rated for 5 watt near 5 watt let's compare to another diode I take this one, this is a module I have built by myself, it mounts the most powerful laser actually, an UBM44 V2 that is rated for 7 watt. We let cool down the Peltier Celt until we reach zero voltage reading, ok, I wear, wire my laser. And, uh, and start okay the measure processor is the same I believe I have a part of the laser out of the Peltier Celt. Okay, this module re reach zero point six hundred eighteen. So we can make a compare between both if you make some measure you can see that uh, the, the ratio between the power measured by the laser power meter and the voltage still the same between different measure so it is a, a linear response that uh, can be compared with uh, uh, the laser power meter so you can use a Peltier Celt for compare and measure laser power